Hi, I'm Clément, this is Gavin, together with Ubic, uh, we are going to make a demonstration about smart street lighting using the, the weightless starter kit of Ubic along with the interfacing of Arduino board. So first, all the way until now, in terms of street lighting, there's been only limitations based on the existing technologies, only uh, procuring uplinks. That means it's good enough just to uh, send data about the light bulbs with regards to their hours of operation and also for example when the light bulb is, uh, is broken but uh, you can actually do so much more you can do more if you use downlink downlink is one of the advanced features of weightless which we're about to show off uh, to give you an example for smart street lighting the way it would happen is that uh, depending on the time of the day when you have sunset and sunrise depending where you are depending on the season you might need to adjust when you switch on and off via remote controls, those light bulbs. That's what we can do. Not only it's possible to do this, you can actually also dim gradually from switch off to switch on and vice versa depending on the time of the day. And this is what actually is a, has been a request from the industry for street lighting. So um, in this demo, we'll actually do a, only on one light bulb with a base station that is around in our, in our office. But uh, typically you could be doing this with a base station that is kilometers away in an urban environment. Uh, for the purpose of our video, Gavin is going to go over uh, the different objects that we have connected with Arduino on the, on the board here and uh, to do a little demo to, to demonstrate how we can do this dimming. All right, so first off, we have the Arduino Duo board, which is actually connected to our power bank here. And then we have a bunch of sensors here. So the first one we have is the PM2.5 sensor, along with the GPS module here. And these two are actually connected through UART to the Arduino board. And then next, we have the temperature and humidity sensor, along with the light bulb, LED light bulb, which is our main sensor for today. And these two are connected through PWM to the, to the Arduino board. And then finally, we have the weightless end device evaluation board. And this is actually connected to our a weightless base station which is connected to a router in our office right now. So now I'm going to be demonstrating the downlink capability of weightless. So what I just did now was I sent a packet through our cloud to the end device which will then uh, work with the Arduino to control the LED light bulb like turning it, turning it on. Now next I'm going to be dimming it further it's quite bright right now. <laughs> right, so okay, so now it's dimmer, and then we're gonna dim it down furthermore. So this is basically demonstrating how we can control the brightness of the LED light bulb. And finally, we'll turn it off. Right. So I see that in just about uh, 15, 20 seconds, we've been sending four or five downlinks. Yeah. Um, so this was just a demo on one light bulb, but you can actually, uh, uh, what we do here is that we could do this with thousands of uh, light bulbs in the streets over a large area. Um, if you have any questions or comments, if you want to have uh, uh, some documentations about this or other demonstrations, just don't hesitate to contact us. Thank you. Thank you.